Hey everybody, welcome to the Taste Spot TV. I'm Tony Bruschi. Today on the show, it's all about the salsa. And I'm not talking the jar of mush like this that you get in the store that has God knows what in it. Today, it's all about fresh salsa and not just regular fresh salsa. We're making fruit salsa, a salsa that is sure to make your friends go, this is amazing. How did you do it? I'm gonna show you how to do that next on the Taste Spot TV. Our first step is chopping up our ingredients. Going for kind of a medium to small dice here. We're gonna get them all mixed up in the bowl. Be sure when you're cutting these, you don't you know mush and beat the heck out of anything because you still want to, everything to retain a shape of some sort, even the oranges. We have all our fruits and vegetables nicely chopped. The orange, not puree, just chopped nicely. Red pepper, red onion, cilantro, jalapeno pepper, and some fresh lime right there. The best thing about doing a fruit salsa is the fact that it is so simple to make. We've got all of our ingredients right here. All you gotta do is just basically put them into the bowl. Obviously, make sure your hands are washed. First thing I'm gonna do is gonna put the oranges in here. And notice the oranges are not pureed or chopped to hell. That's, that's very important. You want them to still retain their shape and some nice little slices in here so it can be kind of chunky of a salsa. We have a whole red pepper diced nice mediumly. We got a red onion that's gonna be going in there. Some jalapeno, be careful with the jalapeno because a little bit goes a long way here. I did the whole thing, seeds and all. We're gonna put that right in there. And of course, my favorite, some cilantro. It adds a nice, fresh flavor to it. Now, I also like to add the juice of a whole lime to this as well. It really adds that nice citrusy flavor to it, especially being a fruit salsa. It uh, really complements the orange really well. And if you sit here going, oh, I can't get this thing to squeeze, here's a little trick I got for you. Just use your teeth, it works fine. Very nice. All right, we got our salsa right there. Let's get it mixed up. You know, kind of toss it lightly. You don't want to overload this with uh, beating the crap on it because that's going to completely defeat our purpose. Look at those nice colors. Top of that, let's add some pepper and a little bit of salt. Even a pinch of sugar we want to get in there too. Of course, the fruits have their own natural sugars, but a little bit of actual refined sugar goes a long way in here too. Let's get that tossed around really nicely, get the colors evenly spread out. Ah, that is nice. There you go. That is our fruit salsa. Simple to make. Your friends will love it. It's a Taste Spot TV fruit salsa today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Tony Bruski.